2.30 a.m. Time to rise and grind. First thing I do is grab breakfast. Wish I had time nice. to cook. But I'm far too busy for that. Oh, why? <laughs> it's been six months since I quit YouTube to trade stocks full time. Social the media. The first comment in this. Wait. <laughs> I'm gonna up. Wait, is that a spoiler? Nice Does he that. call him out the later? Started with just a nice casual jog. Just relax the body. You know, get your blood pumping. God, get a good start I love the day. Mr. Historian so much. But the real much. money is in the stock market. Now we can finally get to work. No, I showed it. There. Are you happy? Chills. Buy Comcoin. Take all your savings, put it in the Comcoin. Day trade that option. Trade that stock. Comcoin is worthless. I sold every last drop of my Comcoin. Sell it, Mark. Sell, sell, sell it all. Sell, sell it all. Buy these options. Buy it. Got it. And that's just a day in the life of a stock trader, baby. I executed the stock trade, and it gave me money. So make sure to tune in next time for. Listen, I don't know how to trade stocks, man. I lost all my money on Robinhood. I have no idea what I'm doing. Holy if shit. only there was something that could trade stocks for me. <laughs>
Well, it's me, the bitch-ass audience. Michael, you can't just represent an entire community with a computer program. Yes, the fuck I can. For this bot to work, we need to know how Wall Street Bets feels about certain stocks. To do this, we're gonna use sentiment analysis, which is a natural language processing technique that uses machine learning. They were looking wow. for my YouTube comments. One says, die forever, bastard. I hate you. A sentiment analysis bot would classify that as negative. And if we look at another one that says, I think you're great. Also, I have a super cool robot idea for you. A sentiment analysis bot would we'll classify that as super fucking negative because your idea probably sucks ass. To train a sentiment analysis bot, you need a lot of labeled data. So a lot of samples of text that are labeled positive or negative by a human. There are a lot of these data sets out there that are publicly available, but the text is like normal person talking. Wall Street bets. They talk about tendies and YOLO and boomers. Pecans or paper hands. Stongs. Just YOLO. It's very unique vocabulary. Therefore, I needed to make my own data set using their fuck weird Wall Street Bets language. So I went to r slash Wall Street Bets, sorted by top of all time, downloaded the top 10,000 posts, and all that's left to do was to label them as positive or negative. So I sat down with a nice cup of coffee and labeled the data myself. <laughs> no, no, that would have taken four or five hours. That's fucking stupid. Instead, I spent an entire month learning the React web framework and building a website that would allow users to log in and label the data for me. Then I tweeted asking uh -huh. Wall Street Bets members to give me their Reddit usernames. I then plugged those usernames into the Reddit API, got the top 10 accounts with the most Reddit karma who were active on Wall Street Bets. Those 10 people labeled 1,000 posts each, 10,000 posts total, and created the data set for me. And that's how you Jesus. turn a five hour task into a one and a half month task, because I'm a programmer. And that's what we do. I nice. use that data set to train a sentiment analysis bot. And now every morning when the fish is trading stocks, this bot is going on r slash Wall Street bet. It's looking through the top posts of the day until it finds one it likes. And then it buys the stock that that post is talking about. So that's how that works. Let's get back to the competition and see which one is better at trading stocks. Insane things are happening, Michael, this right now. This is crazy stuff crazy. going on. Interesting buy from Wall Street bets. I don't Mr. know if the GameStop play is going to work out. People love games, Michael. They fucking love games. Big really tank don't. from Wall Street bet could be like another 9-11 situation. Fish is going crazy buying Costco and, and Facebook? Facebook? Meta. Meta. Meta now. It's a crazy day. There's a lot of volatility right now. Very confusing. I don't know where this one's gonna go. I'm gonna get an expert's opinion on this for sure. I'm gonna take. All set. Hey! This is Graham Stephan. He does financial investing videos and is also rich as fuck. Hello. So you do, you have, you do money. Yeah. You have money. I came to ask you questions. I'm gonna give you two portfolios. I just want you to look them over. Which one do you think is better? Ah, oh, okay. Okay. Portfolio one's interesting. Now portfolio two. Oh, the two. fish ah, portfolio. Okay. We got a lot of the memes here. The market's been down. Pretty much everything has been down the last three months. Yeah. But if I were to, I would feel way more comfortable with the first one. What if I told the you fish that one. an algorithm has picked all of these stocks? I would believe it. I'm gonna give you the performance. Wow. The algorithm is uh, performed. Now, this is only over three months. For the portfolio one is managed yeah. by, more by Frederick. Um, this video is about investing. Yeah. So like maybe giving oh viewers an opportunity to invest into a fund that is managed by my fish. So it's a fish? Yeah. I'm back. Things have been going crazy. What did Graham say? His money is on the fish. Peaks in the valleys for Wall Street's bets. It's better. It's better and bigger than anyone. They can win. Right, Rick but is so smart. Graham's money is on the fish. I fucking hate you, Graham Stevens. Big fall. What the Big fuck fall. was that? Ah! What was that? Huge. It's not looking good for Wall Street Holy bets right shit. now at all. What is that? What is that? This could be it. It's climbing. <laughs> it's the comeback. It's climbing. It's to the what? Moment. It's gonna yeah. break through, bro. It's yeah. gonna Wait a second. It. Oh, it fucking died. The fish won! Let's go back! Yeah. Let's fucking go, Red Red! Fuck you, Wall Street Fets! Get shit on by a fish! Fucking go! go. <laughs> that settles it. Fish is the superior technology. So that's it, right? No. I think I can use this fish technology to create a legitimate business. I've been working on a startup proposal oh, no. for the last couple of days, and I have a meeting set up to try and get some investors. So I'm gonna... It's like a venture capitalist startup meeting. Except it wasn't that at all. It was like this weird fucking hype house for startup founders. So each one of these a people has started house. their own company, and the management has allowed me to pitch my startup idea to them. Hello, everybody. Oh, God. My name is Michael. I'm here what to present a small fintech startup. You've seen it all happening already. <laughs> Articles like this, this, 
this, this. A lot of inexperienced people are losing money in the stock market. That's where Reefly fits in. We have a couple of algorithms going. WSB, mainly sentiment no analysis. No fucking way. Second, fish tracks analyst movement. <laughs> no WSB way. is performing well below market average, but Fish is outperforming the NASDAQ by some 13% last quarter. Honestly, the main reason I'm here <laughs> is because of the performance of that Fish technology. It's performing very well, but generally, we think it can be performing even better. Pretty sure it comes down to a few things. Tank health, clarity, like of the water, we're probably gonna be improving food and like better filters in general. Oh, I already covered that. We need to know how long the fish can perform. <laughs> Looking into the data, the lifespan of this species is generally around eight to 12 years. We think that with better water parameters and more attention to the food, we can get it up to an outlier of 20 plus years. The fish's name is Frederick and that, uh, thank you, do you have any questions? I have a lot of questions. So the fish is determining your stock pick? Yeah, it's fish. It's the it's, well, it's fish is the idea. So um, we've got a front-facing camera. The fish is prompted with two stocks. Whichever side it spends more time on, just that stock. Uh, do you have any more questions? You know, not everyone can see the vision, <laughs> oh and that's God. okay. I'm not, it's not like I'm mad. I'm not, not mad or anything. Fuck! 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 Why don't they understand? Fuck! <laughs> I guess the world just isn't ready for this technology. All I wanted to do was get super, super, super fucking rich. But maybe I don't deserve it, but I think I know someone who does. So I sold all the stocks in the portfolio and withdrew the money. This is the exact amount of money Frederick has made so far, $1,007.59. Can you believe my goldfish made this? And then I went back to where I got him. I got him from this tank. And now he's doing such big things. Excuse me, I'm Aww. looking to get some like better filters and food. They're really good filters. Awesome, I will Aww. grab this. What about food? Stuff like this. Oh, that's some fancy shit. There you go. The, the rest is for Frederick. Sorry? The, it's for Frederick, the rest of it. Frederick? Yeah, the rest is for Frederick. You can keep the rest. Frederick made it. Thank you. Wham, Michael, why did it take you so long to make the video? I don't fucking know. It feels like I blacked out for eight months and still somehow managed to procrastinate the video until the last minute like a dumbass. But hey, still faster than internet historian, baby. That's what matters. And as for Frederick, he made enough money to retire. He'll live out the rest of his days in fish paradise. Why do you have to call up That's Mr. the end of the video. Like Thank that. you for watching. If you liked it, you can subscribe so you can catch my next upload in uh, 2025. Shout out to um, Frederick for making this possible. Shout out to um, God, Jesus, Catholic Jesus. Oh, I made this poster for myself using the data from Frederick versus Wall Street bets because all the graphs needed to be in 8K, so why not? I figured I may as well sell it. So if you want it, you can have it. And if you don't want it, you do not have to get it. It is fucking gargantuan though. It's like my height. I mean, I'm a short what fucking fuck? person, but like it's still a gargantuan Wait, how tall poster. Is he? It's like five feet long. It has all the brands and when they were bought by like who at the exact times. It's very, it's, 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 it's lit. If you want it, you can go to my new URL, pissbaby.com. Baby Five, art three. is no longer my store. Three whatever. feet? I just didn't oh. like the weird toilet humor. I'm 5'3". I'm trying to go in like a more elegant direction. Two Emmys also, tall? I the domain. I'm 5'3". So now, pissbaby.store is my new best friend. It doesn't matter. Jesus. You just click the thing in the description anyway. Yeah. Thank you for watching. Yeah. Okay. Goodbye. See you in a year. See you in a year. The sponsor of this video is public.com. Do you wish you can buy and sell stocks like Frederick? Well, you fucking can't. He's special. But if you want to get close, public is a I'm great place I'm not three to start. feet. It's a Piss free baby LMFAO. Why, why are you guys sharing. like this? Aside from taking zero commissions. I'm 5'3". That's normal for a woman. Investors. That's not even that short. To learn from them. And on top of that, public will never sell your data <laughs> or move your trades to market makers, which is something I learned about when I was making that yeah, uh, I did. I did have the, the... The Hype House launch house. It can cause conflicts of interest. I'm going to upload right now just to make you look foolish. The green app does it. The other one that I'm not allowed to say. You can even follow me at pussy nugget okay um they oh said my I god use that name, so now you are at emeru you at are a gnome in the public app what? i will be investing why do, based on the decision why do you have to go that far i don't get it investing so there are risks but if you understand those risks <laughs> i don't get it public is an excellent place to start investing and learning so if you're interested you can sign up at my link in the description and yeah the i'm waiting for the post credit from scene. three to three hundred dollars i read it in chat thank you again to public for sponsoring this video it was their budget that went to my goldfish and Wall Street bets Did he post? Wait, how soon so after the post though? It was, was like the same day, right? We'll find out. Thank you. Goodbye. Mm. A few hours. That's so sick.
Diamond hands, yes. Is it worth it waiting for the post credit scene? I'm waiting. Where is it? Chat, you told me to wait. I thought he was speaking oh. in an extended metaphor. And I was like, <laughs> I love how trained his mind is to commit so intensely to this analogy of the like the fish to his The algorithm. analogy. Yeah. Oh and my then god. I was like, oh my god, it's a fish. <laughs> Frederick. Good. That's, yeah, that's what we waited for. It's a good video.